What's up guys, today I'm playing Pokemon Twilight. This is another game that was submitted for the Relic Castle 3 game jam, and uh, I thought it looked really interesting. So, let's get cooking. Let's see what's let's see what this game's all about. Sorry to keep you waiting. It's okay, Blaine. I'll wait for you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. Cam4. Hey, both our names start with Cam. What's up, dude? People call me the Pokemon. Professor. If you need help, I'm certainly capable of giving it. Okay. No, thank you. I really like so far the uh, old aesthetic. Oh, look at that. It's like a Pichu in like gold and silver kind of sprite style. I like that. That we call Pokemon. People in Pokemon live. They do. Ah, uh, together by supporting each other. I kind of don't like how little text space there is, but you know, this is what you got to live with when you're playing old games, or at least games style to look like an old game. But we don't know everything about Pokemon yet. There's still many mysteries to solve. That's why I study Pokemon every day. Every day, you say? I'm a boy. Look at me. I'm the uh, the trainer from Pokemon Gold and Silver. Or Crystal. But uh, my name can just be Cam. So far, I'd say this nails the aesthetic. This looks pretty nice. You're Cam? Yes, I am. Are you ready? Your very own Pokemon story is about to unfold. You'll face fun times and tough challenges. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. Yes, let's. Oh, look at that animation. I like that animation a lot. Hurry up, you're gonna be late. Look, am I playing Pokemon Gold and Silver right now? Or am I playing Pokemon Twilight? You know, so far, they've done a good job of making me uh, uncertain. Can I interact with this? It's a show about a Pokemon who lost their trainer. I want to make a game in this old style now that I'm playing this. this. I like this a lot. This looks really nice. Oh, that's the PC. Well, you know me. I gotta get my item. I gotta withdraw my potion, right? Yeah, there it is. Please and thank you. Cool. All right, I want to interact with the map. I guess that's more of a picture just on the wall, though. Oh, I wish it was a map. Down I go. Whoop, there we go. Honey, you need to work on being more responsible. You could have been late. Now the professor wants to give you a Pokemon soon so you can help him with his research. Yay, let's help him out. Make sure to thank him for the Pokemon and be safe. Take these to help you be on time. Running shoes. Yes, let's go. Yeah. I wonder what the uh, running animation... Oh, cool. It looks like I just walk faster. Do, 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 do. That's cool, though. Ba, 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 bow. Down I go. Boo, boo, boo. I go fast. Oh! Lake Bed Village. Look at that. It's like, uh... Officer... What's her name? Jenny? It's closed due to a crime investigation. Oh, no. Route 2. Sand Shrew. Look at this guy. Is this guy... I've always thought that this guy was holding, like, a cup of coffee. Like, that was, like, a mug. Don't bug me, I'm almost to the boss level. But I guess he's playing a Game Boy. But when I was a kid and I saw that, I thought it was just like a mug of coffee and he was just constantly sipping on it. Sometimes I watch television through other people's windows. <laughs> what a creep! Let's see what's, Let's see if there's any good shows though. This time I'm gonna watch television directly. I'm just gonna bypass the guy and see what's on TV. Black and white, oh, very nice. Do you ever get the feeling that somebody's watching you? Like this guy out the window? Oh, what's this song? I've heard this song before. This is a Pokemon song, isn't it? But like a remix oh look you can see like the black border there i like this old style though it's really nice it really is nostalgic to me because i played so much of the old games and uh yeah i know this song this is like a remix of a gen 3 song used to be a lake the lake dried up and people decided to settle here i like this song i just gotta say it and he just brought his game with him ah that's their son that's hanging out outside that's nice Play Pokemon games outside. Anywho, I need to talk to the Professor. I need to stop stop dicking around. Go to the Pokemon lab. Professor! I'm here to help you! Oh, this is the remix of the Professor song from Gen 3. Or not the Professor, the lab song. You there. Give me the Pokemon. Oh. He's not the Professor, of course. This is the Professor. Look at him walk down to me. Cam4. I gotta say, I like your name, Cam4. I'm just Cam. As you know, I'm Professor Cam4. Yes, I know. I study the relationship between our world and the world known as the realm of shadows. I, I'd like to imagine that he's actually speaking like that choppy in real life. You see, the shadows we see on the ground are not merely places where I'm going to stop doing this bit. There are links to the realm of shadows that runs parallel to our world. I've decided to study the realms to, to study this realm as best as I can or as best I can, to learn more about their world and ours. Let's go to the Shadow World. Wait, are you going to send me to the Shadow World? Three ancient relics. <gasps> the trio. 
These relics contain the ability to open a portal to the Realm of Shadows. I like how it's in all caps. That definitely is what they would do in the old games, too. They'd mention a location, but that location is in all caps. Okay, three other islands. The Isla region is made up of four islands. I like this. One for each ancient relic, and one for the Shadow Ruins. It's said that the Isla regions... Isla region is the gateway to the Realm of Shadows. I betcha the Shadow Ruins have something to do with it. But just call it a hunch, you know, I don't know. It's just a theory I have. It's a hypothesis, if you will. These Pokeballs each contain a Pokemon that will be your future partner. Now go on, choose one. Ooh, I get to choose? Spoink? I like Spoink very much, but no thank you. What else we got? So you want Riolu, the fighting? I might have to go with Riolu. Let's see what else we got, though. So you want Zerua, the dark? No thank you. So Spoink is cool, and I really like him. But Lucario is just so good. Let's go, Riolu. Let's let's be let's punch some people up. Give a nickname to him. Yeah. Um. Oh, I thought I could, I could type for a sec. I gotta do this. Let's name him Poncho. How about we name him Poncho instead? So it's like Poncho, but then you change the letter a little bit. Ah, Riolu. That must have been a tough decision. No. Then here are some Pokeballs. I mean, I'm a big fan of Spoink. I think Spoink's one of the cutest of all the of the cute. He's a, he's a top tier cutie for sure. I want to give him a little hug, but then if he stops bouncing, he'll die. So, I don't know. That's 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 a point away from him. There, you will find a sailor who can take you to the islands. Okay, so we got to go to Route One and find a sailor to go to the islands. Head out now. It'll take a while to reach the Harbor Town. In all caps, Harbor Town. Anything else? Harbor Town is to the north, past Route One. Okay, cool. So we know where we're going. The adventure begins. You there, mention how amazing technology is. Did you know that people can now make their own Pokemon games? Technology sure is amazing. They can, and it is. Is this my, this was my house, yeah? Camp's house, cool. Up to the north I go then. Um, I guess maybe Route 1. Oh. Oh, listen to that, they got the, they've almost got like a Rocket Slime kind of sound. If you've ever played Rocket Slime, a lot of the soundtrack is composed of like people going like, do ba ba, do do. There's a lot of do's and da's, and that's what I'm hearing in this. Ooh, what do we got? Holy shit, that's a dramatic battle opening. Oh, look at that, level 13. Goodness, I'm level 15 and shiny. Oh, this I didn't know. Although I'm kind of afraid of him since I'm fighting and he's flying, so I think I'll get out of there. That was impressive though. I like the, uh, I like the old art style. I like the music. They really nailed it. Look at that, that looks so good. That looks really good. Look at me, with the shiny ammo. Oh, look at all this. This is just... I wish, I wish I could see the strength of my moves when I'm choosing them. I guess that's one of the downsides. Although, I don't know if you could do that anyway. Whatever. He protects. Oh, do you see that? The animation for protect was up in the top left corner instead of on him. Oh well. Let's see. I don't really have too many good... A faint's a... Faint's a normal attack? I need to... I need to... Study my moves. I need to get used to what I'm using. Tackle. Oh no! Dude, we're both getting crits. Faint. No! Get him! Destroy him! Aha! So he used protect and faint still hit. Nice. Aha. Cool. So let's uh let's uh get familiar with Oh look, they've even got the little screen there with the guy. That's cool. Oh, this is bringing me all back. This is definitely they nailed the aesthetic very well. Let's see. Look at that. They've even got a... <laughs> attack, defense, special attack, special defense, speed, ability. Cool. The ability you can see. This is like weird almost how accurate it is. So counter... Faint is... Faint's not fighting, is it? I thought faint was normal. Oh, there it says normal, but up top it says fight. Oh, I, I guess they mean in, in a battle? Why does it say fight up top? I don't know. I'm just confusing myself. I'm overthinking it. Faint, 30... Force Palm 60. Is there any, like, special text about it? Oh well. I just gotta choose between Force Palm and Faint, I guess. Anything going on up here? No. Anything going on over here? This will be a trainer battle. You know me, I like to save. Look how accurate that save screen is, too. Oh man. Up we go. When two eyes meet, a battle begins. This is true. And our eyes have met, so a battle shall begin. Oh, look at this. Youngster Charlie. Aha, Zigzagoon. He looks huge. Okay, um, Force Bomb then. 
Mm-hmm. Super effective. Was there a super effective sound there? I have to get used to this. Ooh. I lost? Yes, you did. It was an easy battle, too. I didn't think I would lose. Well, you did. My sister is looking for wild Pokemon in the tall grass over there. She left me stranded here, surrounded by tall grass, but I'm scared of Pokemon. What's there to be scared of? They're just violent animals. Nah, they're fine. You'll be fine. You there! You abandoned your sister! How irresponsible! Did you know we are currently on one of the four islands? Yes. Did you know that you live on an island? <laughs> wow, really? I didn't know. I've just been living in my house for 20 years. And now, I, now I've emerged into this mysterious world. Harbor Town. Oh, cool. I like how short that first route was. Let me just say I'm a big fan of that. Shh, the tree is speaking to me. All right, you're crazy. <laughs> All right, I'll leave the crazy alone. I told my daughter that she couldn't go in the wild grass alone, so she brought her brother. Well, she got uh, she got abandoned. Or maybe that was somebody else. I thought it was brother and sister. You there! My big sister dared me to jump off this ledge. I'm too scared. I can do it, you baby! Ha! There we go. Oh, that'd have been cool if there was like an event where like when you passed over this ledge, whoop, he would talk to you and go, wow, you're so brave. Harbor Town is known for its famous sailor. It's known for one sailor. Wow, there's a sailor who lives in Harbor Town. What a big deal. Oh, this Pokemon Center is quite empty. And there's no maps on the wall. I need a map. I want to see the islands. Let me see. Okay. Oh, for a second, I thought that was the PC. This is the PC. I don't know why I'm opening the PC. I got nothing to look at. I've only got one Pokemon. I don't even have any Pokeballs. I gotta get some money. You, is this where the sailor lives? Docks. Okay. That'll be where the sailor takes me. But I want to see what else is going on. There's the Mart. What's going on in here? Can I buy some cool stuff? This place is, like, empty, too. There gotta be some NPCs in here talking about how cool it is. I got some money. Okay, it's good to always have an escape rope on you. Always have at least one. Just in case. Just in case. Um, potions, super potions, great balls and pokeballs. I'll probably buy some pokeballs. See if I can catch something cool. It'd probably be a good idea to catch that Starly back there, or go back and catch a Starly. Um, I'll just buy like two potions. I don't think I'm really gonna need to use them too much. And maybe just one super potion. There we go. I mean, I don't know what else I'm gonna use any of my money on. All right. Um, I want to try to catch a Starly real quick. We'll see how that pans out, though. Ooh! I don't want to catch this Minun. I want to kill it. This might be a tough battle, though. I could just always go back and heal. Quick attack. Oh, shit. That did, like, not a whole lot of damage. That did some damage. If you want to learn how to do damage, Minun, look no further. I'm the damage guy. Look at all that. Huh. So it looks like all the effects, or not all of the effects, but a lot of the effects for, like, the defaults that don't have animations play in the top left corner. <gasps> Ooh, level up! Do I learn anything cool? Nope. Oh well. I guess I'll save after making my purchases. My egregious item purchases. Come on, give me a Starly. Give me a Starly. And then I can advance. I want to have at least one flying Pokemon, so that way if I do get fly, I can fly between the islands more freely. Another Minun, huh? Well, I mean, I'm not I'm not going to turn away free experience now. I mean, it's free, and it was a lot. Oh, shoot. Never mind. It's not free, and no Thunder Wave. That's not good. That's not good at all. I got to get the hell out of here. Or I could try to take it out still. <laughs> Helping hand. I really don't like that move. And maybe it's just because I never do doubles, but it's like a doubles exclusive move where it powers up your partner's attack, but, like, most of the battles in this are going to be single. I mean, maybe in a game where it was only doubles. I thought about doing that, making a game where it's only double battles. Um, maybe in that, Helping Hand would be better, but still, it's like... I don't know, it seems kind of like a waste of a slot. I don't know, maybe I'm just too one-track mine. My pea brain only wants to launch attack moves. So, when I see... When I see moves that aren't attacks, I go... <laughs> That's the exact reaction I have, it makes no sense. Isn't that wonderful? Yeah, it's okay. Did I check out this house yet? I didn't. Hello there, old people. I still live with my mom. Oh. I have the weirdest dreams. Must be Darkrai's doing. Oh, Darkrai, huh? Town map. No. TV. The TV is broken. Dude, you live with your mom and 
Your TV's broken, you gotta fix it for her so she can watch TV. Come on. Be a good boy. Or at least, you know, fix it so you can watch it. Play some video games. What's the term? Neat? N-E-E-T? Not employed. Something... Education, employed, or in training? It's a shiny Burmy! Well... You know, I gotta try to catch it then. What? It doesn't really look shiny from here, though. It looks like the same as other the others. What are the odds of running into a shiny wild Burmy right now? Who would have thought? Stop protecting yourself. I will get you. Haha. Alright. I guess I might as well catch it, though. I feel kind of inclined to catch it since it's a shiny. But my target is Starly. My target is a Starly. One more feint ought to do it. Come on, no crit. There we go. Let's catch it. Let's catch it on a whim. Oh, look at that item bag. <laughs> That's, oh, I have 25 Pokeballs? I had 20 from the beginning? I didn't know this. What the? That's insane. Now I don't feel bad at all about just chucking some Pokeballs at this little shiny piece of crap. <laughs> I don't know. I don't really... I'm not, a, I'm not a fan of Burmy. You may call me a Burmy hater. Get in the ball. Just join my team so I can move on with my life. Yes. There we go. One shiny down. Now my team is composed 100% of shinies. Isn't that kind of crazy? I'm going to name him Mermo. Because I like it. I like... For some reason, I just really like names that end with O. Like, uh, Poncho. Burmo. Bumbo. Bringo. Stungo. Really dumb names. Uh, I could catch a Zigzagoon. It might be nice to have a Pokemon with Pickup on my side. But I want that Starly. You know me. You know me. I'm, I'm gonna one-shot this guy. I'm gonna get him out of my face. Excuse me, Zigzagoon. I got, I got a Starly to catch. Where the hell are they, man? I... It was the first Pokemon I saw, and then I haven't seen one ever again. Hmm. Hmm. I'm spending too much time just running around with wild Pokemon. I need to... I need to get this episode on the roll. On the... On the go. <laughs> on the roll. <laughs> what am I saying? What am I doing? What am I thinking? Goodness gracious me. Maybe I should, uh, just run back to the starting grass patch. I'm, uh, I'm a little bit superstitious sometimes when it comes to that stuff. I know it doesn't make any difference, but sometimes I, I believe in one grass patch over another, if that makes any sense. Let's, uh, let's run the hell- oh my goodness. No! No! Alright, now I'm just gonna say screw it. I'm gonna take out this Minon, and I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna go up to the Pokemon Center, and I'm gonna go on the dock. I don't care anymore. This Minon has crushed my spirit. What the? Okay, cool. I didn't know- I forgot Force Palm has a chance to paralyze enemies? I guess, uh, I forgot about that. Put that on the list of things that I don't remember happening. Ah, there's the paralyze. There it is. And <laughs> cool, we're both paralyzed. Alright, fine. I'm cool with this. This works for me just fine. Besides, these Minons are giving crazy experience. That's some good stuff. Look at that! Look at that! That's... that's so much. That's like too much. That's a... that's an unfair amount. God damn, I was kind of hoping that on my last little bit there it would be a, uh, Starly. But it's not. At least I get to run. So what did we get out of that? We got a shiny Burmy. That's what we got. Look at them. Okay. So, you know, not too great of a haul, but... We take it, I guess. I, I'm sure there'll be no shortage of flying Pokemon in other areas. We'll just have to catch some flying Pokemon later, I guess. I hope I get an EXP share soon. I like EXP shares, because I'm a filthy casual. I don't like grinding too much. I prefer to just adventure onward. What the? Th you, this is a dock? This looks like a little radio room. Is that... what's going on here? Are you the sailor? Oh, hello there. You must be Cam. The professor told me you would arrive soon. We don't get many visitors here. Anyway, make sure you are prepared for the battles ahead. Are you ready to sail away? Battles? Let me hit no, and then save, and then go. Oh, what's this? Oh. Looks like a nice little picture there. Ooh, Harbor Town docks. The whole screen is filled. Alright. There'll be strong foes ahead. Make sure you're prepared. Cobalt Island? Yes, let's go. Off to Cobalt. Oh, damn, it just... Okay. 
It's all up to you now. But first, take this. Yay! Oh, I like this song a lot. This is a good song. Is there a very strong foes ahead? That being said, come to me if you need your Pokemon healed. Oh, cool! Nice. Thank you, uh, Sailor. No wonder they talked about the Sailor so much. He's a very cool guy. He's a stand-up swell dude. Okay. I just want to explore the boundaries just to make sure I'm not missing anything, you know, like no hidden items or anything. Alright. To Cobalt Island. What's going on? Oh! Unknown Ruins? Is this the Shadow Ruins? It says Shadow Ruins on the... No, wait. What does it say? Cobalt... I, uh... No. Cobalion... Rises. Okay, so the trio is the, uh... The trio is the, uh... Black and white, like... What are they called? The Defenders? The... Ne but yeah, that says Cobalion Rises. Okay. Does he now? Oh, here we go. We got ourselves a nice little puzzle. Well, not, not so much a, a puzzle and more of a maze. Woobat will do just fine for a flying type. I think Woobat can learn uh, fly, right? Oh, shit. It's probably better for me to just run from this. Woobat is the culmination of things I don't like. Psychic and flying? Uh, pass. I think I'll pass. Oh, look at Zubat. I forgot how derpy Zubat looked. Is that his old sprite? He looks like he's like... majority of his body is head, and then he's got like small little tendrils coming off. I could go get that item. Ah, oh, man, I probably should. What is it with this place? Team Rocket's here! That maze was hard enough, but now this? <laughs> they found that maze to be hard? Okay. Tell me about it. We can't reach the exit. The boss will be furious. Yeah, his hopes for Team Twilight are high. <laughs> Team Twilight? Are you Team Rocket? But your Team Twilight instead? Is this Double Battle? Ooh, listen to this theme! Oh, this is like a remix of the, uh, Ruby and Sapphire. Oh, shit. How am I gonna take out this guy? What can I do? What can I do? Can I do anything? I can't do anything! Well, that sucks. That's just... That's just... That's just awful. I can't hurt this guy. I can't counter him. I can't force palm him, because both those are fighting. I could try to endure. This is so dumb. I just... I can't... I can't do anything. My only hope is to use Burmy against this guy. Like, come on, man. What? So do I have to actually go grind? I don't want to have to grind. That's not fun. Okay. Go. Oh, now he's pink. Now he's shiny. He only knows protect and tackle. Are you serious? I literally can't hurt Duskull. All right, well, I guess I'll just hold this L. Maybe I need to catch more Pokemon. Maybe I should have caught that Starly. Damn. Oh, cool. Now my tackle is disabled. Nice. All right. <laughs> what? Now I have to spam protect? Are you serious? This is awful. I just want to die. But they won't let me die because I have to protect. Maybe. I mean, since this is like a guaranteed loss, maybe I should just reset. What is it? F12? There we go. Let's get back into it. Let's get back into it. So I saved in Cobalion Ruins. I should probably train. Let's see what's up with this item. That sucks, though. A Duskull? Man. Ooh, an Aron. Aron? I want to catch it. I don't want to kill it. Oh, man. Should I just do counter? Oh, no. My accuracy. Here we go. Okay. Right on. Um, if I do Force Palm, that might kill it. Let's try, at least. Come on, baby. Oh, yeah. No, it has, uh, Sturdy. Perfect. So, usually I hate Sturdy, but in this case, I'm pretty glad to see some Sturdy. I'm pretty glad to see some... Get in the ball, you big boy. Let's go. He'll be my key to beating Duskull. Although, Duskull spamming Nightshade's pretty bad for me. That's not good at all. Yeah, I'll name him, uh, Rockman. Or Rockman. As a reference to the Mega Man franchise. Rockman. Cool. Alright, let's get that item at least while I'm here. Five Ultra Balls. Ooh. Very good. Hmm. So, knowing that my first real challenging fight is a Duskull makes me kind of wish that I got... Um... What's his face? The cute one, Spoink. Yeah. Kind of makes me wish I got Spoink. 
Although, I guess this is kind of like a live and learn scenario. I got my air on at least, though. On it. That's one of the downsides of games where you have three starters. Sometimes you'll get a starter that's just terrible against... Although, I mean, you can always just catch more Pokemon. The fact that they gave me 20 uh, Pokeballs at the beginning makes me a lot less salty. If I had to buy the Pokeballs to catch something to affect Duskull, I would be kind of salty, but now it's like, whatever. I, they gave me a plenty, I can handle myself. I can catch other Pokemon and try to... What? A, I need to see what my moves are on Aeron. I guess I'll find out right now. Let's go! Let's go, Rockman! Take him out! Okay, he knows... Mud Slap. Metal Claw. That'll be fine against, uh... What's his face? Against, uh, Duskull. That'll be fine. Look at me, taking no damage, too. Let's go. Rockman. Rockman kicking ass. Oh, no. <laughs> Did you see that the supersonic kind of, like, went up and to the right? Oh, no! Hit him! Take him out! Yeah. Cool. I guess I'll have to try my luck against Duskull. If anything... <sighs> Man, so if Aeron dies, I have no moves that can affect it. So it's not merely a case of me just mud slapping and lowering its accuracy. I have to kill it, which is going to be tough. Especially since it's going to be spamming Nightshade, which is going to be doing 16 damage each turn. So I can take three hits. So essentially, I have to kill it in three hits before it kills me in three hits. I mean, I could get lucky and it could use Astonish, which you just saw does like no damage. But it's not looking good for me. It's not looking good for me. The odds are not in my favor. I can save and just try a battle. But, yeah. Just, like, mathematically speaking. Maybe I should go back and train against those Minuns and Plusles. Those were given out a great experience. Although I hate grinding, dude. I hate grinding. Let's just see what I can do here. I really, like, especially if I'm recording and I'm doing, like, a playthrough. I don't I mean, although a lot of this episode was me kind of grinding for that Starly. But you know what I mean. Like, I don't want to spend a lot of time just battling while talking over me fighting wild Pokemon. Let's see if I can take this guy out right now. That's the hope. Metal Claw! hey -ya. So far so good. Yes! Attack Rose. That's pretty clutch. Shit. That's not good. Metal Claw disabled. That was kind of like my big moneymaker move. That was my damager. How to... No! It has Levitate! You shit! You're kidding me! How'd you, how are you going to disable my best move? How are you going to disable my best move? And now none of my other moves can hit you. Are you serious? Okay, cool. I guess I'll just harden up there in the top left corner. I got nothing else to do. And now it's going to nightshade me for 16. That's some BS. Come on. Come on. That's my only chance. That was, that was my move. Oh my goodness. Okay, cool. At least I'm not taking any damage from Astonish. That's fine. Okay. Disable no more. Cool. Metal Claw. Get him out of here. Get this boy out of here. Smack him. Smack him down. Oh my god. Stop that disable BS, dude. Okay. I gotta heal this turn. I gotta heal. And using my revive is a potential option. I don't want to do that, though. What I want to do is just Metal Claw him. Okay, cool. Yeah, the more he uses Astonish, the better. If, if he stays away from Nightshade, I'm looking good. So Mud Slap missing is depressing, though, but I can just spam Harden in the meantime. I think we got this. I think we can do this. This is looking pretty good for me. Yeah, he's just spamming Astonish. I'm 100% I'm okay with this. If you just want to keep Astonishing me... Yeah, it's still disabled. Okay. If you just want to keep on using Astonish, by all means. I really like that Duskull sprite, by the way. I didn't mention that earlier. It looks really good. It looks really good. Come on. Here we go. It looks really good, but fuck you, Duskull. You know... Get him out of here. Yes! And I got the second attack rise, too. Let's go. Let's go, Rockman. Coming in clutch. And that Duskull still gave less experience than the Minuns and Plusles. What's the deal with that? Hell yeah. Obstacle overcome! Step aside. Let me try. Now I don't have to grind. Unless I lose this battle, which would be terrible. What, is, what has he got? Sableye. Oh, goodness. More ghosts. That's not cool. I guess uh, second verse, same as the first. Metal Claw him. And he's got Nightshade also. Okay, cool. I can still tank a couple more of those. Foresight. Ooh, cool. Yeah, if he just wants to use other moves, that's cool with me. I'm just going to keep spamming. Yes! Cool, I think I'm like guaranteed to win now. 
Astonish? You got nothing, Sableye. You got nothing. And another critical hit. Rockman is a beast. Good job, Rockman. I got a I got a snap for Rockman. Iron defense? That's better than Harden, eh? Yeah, it's just better than Harden. Sure. I'll take a I'll take a, a flat upgrade. I don't have to really think about it too much. It's just draft it's just it's just better. Cool. Rockman. You you honest to god hero. I was about to get a promotion. Well <laughs> you suck, sir. What is this madness? This guy beat us with a Pokemon he just caught in the cave. Oh. Yeah. Well, that was cool. I guess I'll save. Uh, thank you guys for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll, uh, I guess I'll continue this episode, uh, this series, uh, in the next part. I mean, duh. Oh, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'm really happy with, uh, how our run worked out. But yeah, goodbye. <laughs>